it's uh, as you guys can see it's almost six but uh, it's still not time for fajr and uh, yeah traveling to tunis inshallah This is the old uh, streets of the city. Ustadi, in the Arabic language, is from Syria. I said to him, I am going to travel to Tunis. Do you know anyone? He said, I only know one person. His name is Fawzi. Oh, God. He said, if you found him, he said, he said, I heard the first 48 hours in a country is where you actually understand or reflect the most. This is just the first hours and uh, just walking in the streets. I just met one man. He gave me the key to the hotel. He said, just open it and go in. There you can see the moon. The fact that it's almost uh, almost all of it is gone means that we are in the middle of the month of the Islamic month. Uh, right now the time is six, almost six thirty, and in Tunis the mosque they are actually close them when it's not prayer time. So close to Fajr now they're going to open the mosque. Subhanallah, imagine all the tourists coming to the city. They have no idea this is happening in the morning when they're asleep. This is Jamia to Zaytun, one of the oldest universities in the world, and uh, it used to be center of education in Al Azhar. And they have written words from the Quran. كاف ها يا عين صاد ألف لام ميم راء طه يا سين طاسين. I'm very interested to see how what's happening inside the university now. I'll see.
Subhanallah. Uh, what's interesting is that even though things seem chaotic, you can easily just enter the university. You can easily. I just spoke to the president of the university. Salam alaikum. Shukran li musaada. Barakallah fiq. Shukran ala waj. So, Jamaat Uz Zaitun is the oldest university in Tunis, and right now actually it's the smallest. And uh, the president of the university told me that uh, this is the only university in uh, Tunisia which actually they do their education in Arabic. All of the other universities is in French. And it's also the only university that uh, teaches uh, Islamic studies. Today is the 20th of December. In here you get to buy everything basically. في هذا المسجد درس المؤرخ علامة عبد الرحمن بن خلدون. إذا نمسكين هار. In this masjid, in English, this is the place where Ibn Khaldun studied. That is what is basically said. And here you see, right next to the place where Ibn Khaldun studied, you see bookstores. And very close to the mosque, you find this building. And it says, "في هذا الدار ولد مؤرخ العلامة عبد الرحمن ابن خلدون." In here, Ibn Khaldun was born. Right now, it's closed. And I was told this supposed to be a public museum. They are renovating it, but per December 2022, it's not open yet. This place's name is Kaftaji Fauzi and known as the best place to make Kaftaji in Tunis as you can see from the lines. Just uh, in Tunis a lot of people when they see you they say Aish which means uh, live. Like live is interesting because uh, in Urdu the same word means Ash Ashkaro. Ashkaro which means uh, like, it means like waste like live. Just like live it out, but in Arabic it means live like may, may you live long. It's a nice thing which they say a lot. الشيطان الرجيم سمعون الكذب أكلون للسحت فإن جاءك فحكم بينهم أو أعرض عنهم. so this Quran is is helping you in تجويد the mosque مسجد زيتونة it opens again during ظهر time which is now. The mosques in the Muslim world is they are part of nature. They're part of the environment around them and people get everything in it. Like imagine this is December and people are here in the mosque with their families. They're getting the sun, they're getting the fresh air, they're seeing animals, the, the birds, and they have the prayer area right, right there. Here the mosque made the people come. People made houses around the mosque, people stayed around the mosque and it created a whole environment.
انت من هنا؟ ها؟ انت من هنا؟ تونس ما شاء الله تدرس؟ درست قبل درست من قبل الان الان هنا فقط في زياره في زياره في تونس تشرفنا تشرفنا بكم عجبتك تونس؟ نعم جميل هذا يوم يوم ثاني يوم ثاني اليوم اه جيت امبارح انا نعم الامس جيت الامس جميل هذا تعلمت العربيه في باكستان؟ لا لا درست اللغه العربيه في الاردن اه في الاردن نعم درست في الاردن تشرفنا بكم اسمك كريم؟ حيدر حيدر؟ حيدر ما شاء الله حيدر مثلا اسد حيدر ليه <تصفيق> 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 هو قيروان ما شاء الله قيروان هو هو افضل هو ليس افضل هو اقدم هو رابع هو رابع هو رابع هو رابع هو رابع هو رابع هو Seeing this, you just think how honored is our Prophet This is in Tunis. Um, we know Tunis as a Muslim country, but it's so far away from Medina, the city of the Prophet. It's in Northern Africa. It's so close to France and Spain and Italy. And for so long in this masjid in here, they have been sending salawat about Salawat to our Prophet Muhammad Sallallahu Alaihi Wasallam SubhanAllah, how Allah honors His Prophets And look at all this time built Used in this masjid <laughs> Yeah. Uh -huh. 